Hey, you're watching Adafruit on YouTube. This is the show about 3D printing and DIY electronics. Today we're going to 3D print an enclosure for the Raspberry Pi A Plus featuring the Adafruit 2.2 inch Pi TFT. Let's make this little guy. With this project, we can make a small Astro box that puts our 3D printer on the Wi-Fi network. The Astro print image is easy to install and it lets us control the printer with any device on the network. We put together the enclosure in Fusion 360 using sketches. The three parts snap fit together with friction and most of the ports are accessible. The parts nicely fit on the printer bought Simple Metal and you can pick one up from the Adafruit shop. The zebra plate from Printin Z makes removing the prints so much easier and really beats blue painters tape. The parts print with no support material and it takes just under two hours. They came out looking exceptional using Cura with default settings and slicing profile. You only need to solder the socket header to the GPIO pinout on the display, but be sure to check out the guide linked below for a full tutorial. It's a lot easier if you tack the header to the PCB and use a pan of ice to keep it sturdy while you solder. The Pi TFT snaps on top of the Raspberry Pi and the 3D printed spacers keep the two PCBs in place. It slides into the case at an angle, and the clips on the edges keep them from coming out. The ports line up nicely with the cutouts, and everything just snap fits together. NinjaFlex makes great rubber actuators for the buttons on the display. Keep the protective film on until the last step. Place the cover over the display and press the edges into the case to close it up. You can use any 5 volt battery or power source with a micro USB cable. And now we have our mini AstroBox. The Pi TFTs make great displays for small Raspberry Pi projects. And there you have it, yet another 3D printed enclosure for the Raspberry Pi. So if you've created an enclosure using 3D printing, let us know in the comments because we want to see what you guys are working on. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram, I'm at Ekin. But until then, thanks so much for watching guys and don't forget to subscribe for more 3D printed projects from Adafruit.